what's up guys my name is Fizan Amjad and in this video I'm going to show you how you can create amazing building row effect in CapCut so I have this clip and now I'm going to select the first frame and now let's freeze the first frame of this video now let's click here and we can export this still frame now guys open the browser and search for photoroom.com now let's go to the background remover now we have to upload that picture right here so it removed the background of the picture but guys we have to also add the motion blur to this picture so let's go to the edit in photo room now we have to select this object and now we have to open this blur and we have to add motion blur and now i'm going to add 9px motion blur now guys we have to place this picture right here because photo room add a watermark so afterward we can crop the watermark so i'm going to download this picture let's click on continue and if i open this picture as you can see guys this is the watermark i am talking about now guys search for magicstudio.com and then scroll down and then we have to select use magic eraser for free now we have to upload the picture right here and now i am going to select the building so it will remove the building and then we have the empty background now you can scale it up or scale it down the brush size from this control and now let's click on erase and now here we go now we have to click on this download button and then we have to download at low resolution now we have to drag that asset and we have to drop that in timeline so i have the background and now we have the building and now first of all i'm going to crop the watermark of this website and now i'm going to align my building according to the video so i am going to align this to right here and then i'm going to also guys go to the speed and i'm going to speed up my clip to 5px and now guys i'm going to select this building let's go to the mask select this mask and i'm going to mask this part of the building now i'm going to also add 3px feather let's copy this and let's paste this right here on top of this track and now i'm going to select the mask and i'm going to select this part of the building this time now we have to paste this video again on top of this now select this one go to the animation and in animation i'm going to select slide up animation now i'm going to also apply this to other part of the building or the tower and then i'm going to align these right here now here we go now i'm going to also select the first track go to the video and go to the basic and set this to one so it will slide from under this part i'm going to select this part and layer this to number two so it will slide under this layer and now if we play this video now you can see we have this smooth building row animation now i'm going to also go to the animation and in duration i'm going to also set this to two this one to two and this one to three so now we have this animation now you can also align this right here now we have this animation now i'm going to also select these asset split these delete these and now we have this effect now guys i'm going to also go to the effect and in basic folder i'm going to drag a camera shake let's increase the speed lower the range and let's split this now i'm going to trim this effect and now i'm going to increase the range select this one increase the speed select this one increase the range and decrease the speed so we have the render camera shake and now i'm going to select this video and i'm going to make or create a compound clip now guys go to the transition and apply this in effect folder apply this glare transition and now here we go so i'm going to just decrease the duration of this transition now after do some color grading and color correction here we have the final result